Good morning to one and all. My name is Joseph. I'm just going to run through um, how to configure LDAP server on the controller and map it to your WLAN for using LDAP. So uh, the basic thing first here is you need an LDAP server. You can use an LDAP server uh, with credentials. Just use a name password on that. First, you need to create an LDAP server. So um, I'm just going to create an my LDAP server on this controller. Go to config terminal and LDAP server. Name the LDAP server WCM hyphen LDAP one. Say in case you have different LDAP servers, LDAP one, and then I need to give the IP address of the LDAP server minus nine six forty six dot one zero eight. Then I need to give the credentials. The first one is bind authenticate. I give my root DN. Joseph, my username, password is, let's hide this out, I give my password, then I give the base DN, C equal to com, so my LDAP server is ready now, so uh, what I do is I just go take a look, show LDAP so uh, give the name here WCM hyphen LDAP one okay. summary. So this is the LDAP server which I have con uh, configured con currently. So after I configure on the LDAP server, I need to map the server to a LDAP server group. So again, config terminal AAA group server system LDAP and I name the server group here WCM LDAP and I add the server which I created earlier here server and I give the name WCM LDAP1 which is this guy the server name here enter exit so I have created this server group here the third step here is to create the authentication authorization network and authorization credential download method lists. So uh, again to play authentication dot one X and I just name the method. I'm just going to name it, uh, give it my name here and local. LDAP authentication is done through the local server itself. So uh, the LDAP just gives your authorization credentials. So you have to use your local uh, database and your local server to do your e-transactions. To play authorization, authorization network. Again, I'll just name the method list. I give local. So the authentication and the authorization will be done by the local server and the credential will be provided by my LDAP server. So credential download, I'll again give my name here just to avoid confusion, group and I give the group which I configured earlier that we see on the LDAP. Okay. Now after this, the fourth step is to map the method lists to be used on the local authentication. Now I might have different LDAP servers and different method lists configured. So for the local authentication, what is the method list I should use? So that I have to define. Authentication, I'll give the authentication method list I created. An authorization, I'll give the authorization credential download method list I created here. Okay, so my AAA part and the LDAP configuration part are all ready. Now all I have to do is configure my WLAN and connect the client. So for configuring the WLAN, 
before configuring the WLAN, since this is all done on the local server, I need to have a EAP profile defined on the local server. So let me create one EAP profile named NGWC hyphen EAP. And you can add a lot of method lists, methods here like leap, fast, or whatever. I just add the basic one method leap exit. Now let me go ahead and create a W create sorry, WLAN NGWC LDAP. And I give the ID. Now I have to define the e profile this is going to use. Local auth and the name ngwc hyphen eep then I give the authentication method list security.onex authentication list is the .onex authentication list I create then I give the client vlan Some will I give here and no shut. Exit. Exit. Okay. Now I have to go to my client. I have a client here which is going to connect. So let me search. Okay, here it is. And I set it to leap. Okay. Now it prompts me for the username and password. I'll give my LDAP username and password here. Okay, it's done. And it's client summary. It's up here. And show LDAP. Server WCM hyphen LDAP. One statistics so it gives my search success here bind request and bind response so this is how you uh, create an LDAP uh, server map it to a WLAN and connect a client thank you